Now to the pandemic. New York City could soon increase its COVID alert level, but help is on the way. Sources say the FDA authorization of booster shots for kids 5 to 11 is imminent. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lands is live outside Pfizer headquarters with what this means in the fight against the coronavirus. Shante. Yes, Charlene, that means that the boosters could be approved as early as today, which means the shots could go in arms of children as early as this Friday or Saturday. That's a kids between the ages of 5 and 11. Now, a source confirms to ABC News that the, the, the CDC advisory panel will be meeting to review the data on the boosters. If the CDC panel votes in favor and the CDC director approves, as I mentioned, those boosters could go into arms by this weekend. I also want you to take a look at your screen at this chart. We are currently in yellow. That's the medium coronavirus alert level. City health officials say now because of the fifth COVID wave, New York City expects to enter a high COVID alert level, which is in the orange. That's expected to happen in the coming days. Health officials are especially asking people who are at increased risk for severe illness, like children under the age of five and people over 65, to avoid non essential indoor gatherings. The recommendations are not mandates. Mayor Eric Adams has not signaled that he wants to return to those regulations, but he says he's watching this situation closely. We have a testing system in place that no one else in the country is able to do so. So what does that mean? Someone gets COVID, they stay home. They're not doing what we were doing before, going out and infecting others. They're staying home. We now have the antivirus. We didn't have that before. Uh, we have more tools, so we don't have to fight the war we had before. This is a new war, and we're going to use all those tools to do so. And with that fifth wave on the way, the city's health commissioner is urging everyone to now wear their masks while in inside public spaces.